what is up my beautiful people you are welcome to my channel in case you're new here my name is miriaki and in case you're not new here thank you so much for stopping back by again boo today's video is um just a simple eyeshadow look i'm gonna be creating on my dark skin girl and a few persons have walked up to me especially dark skin girls and they're like um Many a times I put my eyeshadow and it doesn't pay off, the color doesn't pay off like or the pigments don't show but I'm here to like show you the trick guys. I'm here to show you how to actually make your eyeshadows pop if you have dark skin. So I'm just done with filling in her brows lightly. I'm done with her foundation. I'll just be showing you guys the eyeshadow trick very straight to the point. So I'm done with her foundation and I'm just filling in her brows right now lightly and cleaning them off. I used the shade Elegant Pro Conceal in the shade Fun for her eyebrows to clean her eyebrows. So, yeah. Moving on, I'm just trying to blend that um, concealer into her skin. And then the simple trick here, guys, is just to use a concealer shade or a base that is really, really light. Yeah, and in this case, I'm using Elegant Pro Conceal in the shade, I think, porcelain if i'm pronouncing it correctly yeah i think porcelain yeah and i'm just applying it basically applying it all over her lid and i'm gonna leave it there for like um some minutes so that i can start drying up and get tacky before i'll go ahead and blend yeah that's the simple secret okay we that don't have like if you don't have like the money to get the luxury p louise base and some of the Huda Beauty, like the concealers that are so expensive, like the high-end good um, concealer bases. Yeah, just go ahead and use one of the elegant shade, uh, shades that are so light. If you're a dark skin girl like her, and trust me, your color is going to pay off. Like the shadow you're going to apply on top of that is going to pay off. So in this case, I just applied something small because the... Um, the look I'm going to be going in for is actually a very simple, mild look. So I didn't really pack on much of that concealer. So yeah, I'm going into this uh, Juvia's Place palette and I'm using the orange shade. I'm putting that orange shade in between the concealer I applied earlier on and her um, crease shade that I applied to earlier on. No, the espresso that I applied earlier on. I'm just packing that on and making sure everything is blended in so nicely i'm using a real techniques brush going back into that same juvia's place palette i'm using this burgundy shade and the brown shade here to like carve out her outer v and i'm telling her to look up so i can actually like see the shape of her eye and how like to place the color i'm just putting it at her outer v and trying to bring it a little bit I'm bringing it a little bit at her outer V, yeah. So mm -hmm, just make sure you like, you know, you know how we do it, right? You just make sure you blend, blend, blend. That's always the key. Going back in with that orange shade to like blend in the edges of the other shade we just applied right now. And for her lid color, I'm gonna be putting this shimmery shade still in the same Juvia's Place palette. And I'm going to be packing that onto her lid generously, okay? <laughs> yeah, so that is just a trick, my dark skin ladies. That's just a trick. Get a good base and trust me, your colors are going to pay off. If I wanted this lid color to be more like eminent, I would have really like added the base so much and then apply it when it was still wet. So I just wanted to like pop out that um, eye look more and I used this pigment of mine to i just applied a little bit on the main lid color yeah and we had a little bit of shine there mm -hmm. guys can you see what that pigment just did to her eyes oh my god i'm loving i'm loving i'm loving this it's a nude simple nice subtle look 
wow oh my god she's pretty okay guys thank you so much for watching this video thank you so much and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel in case you haven't don't also forget to turn on the notification bell that's just beside the subscribe button so that you are going to be instantly notified when any of my content go up see you all in my next one thank you so much for watching again peace out love you all